welcome back to my channel. Long time no see. I know it's been a while. So first I had a cold, had no voice, I sounded like a dude, and then got sunburnt and started peeling everywhere, like face, hair, body. So today I'm wanting to do a look that could be worn for prom, since it is prom season, but you can also wear it on a date, going to the mall, to Walmart, wherever you're going. First, I'm going to start off with the skin. I'm going to use the Urban Decay Quick Fix Spray. I'm going to switch that all over the face. And then I'm going to go in with the Josie Moran Whipped Argon Oil Face Butter. I'm going in with the Milk Makeup Blur Stick. I don't know if you guys have tried this yet, but you could wear this without your makeup and this completely blurs everything. And when I say blur, I mean you look face tuned. Hello. Everything is gone. So I just put it on my cheeks where I have larger pores. A little bit on my nose, chin, maybe a little bit on the forehead. So for foundation, I'm using the NARS Sheer Glow Foundation in the shade Santa Fe. I got a little tan when I went to the lake, so I had to get a darker foundation. all over the face. Okay, next I'm going to use the Tarte Shape Tape in the shade Light Sand. And then to set that, I'm using the Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder to buff that out under the eye so there's no creases. And I'm going to use that same powder and I'm going to set the rest of my face. Whoa, what happened? To contour the face, I'm going to use Kat Von D's Shade and Light Palette. To use the middle shade, which I think is called Shadow Play. Stop stalling in the doorway. You can't 
For blush today, I'm going to use Burnt Pepper by MAC. To highlight, I'm using Jeffree Star Cosmetics Skin Frost in Siberian Gold. Compared to like the Becca highlighters, like what? Okay, so now that you're highlighted to the gods and looking oily as all get out, on to the brows. So for the brows today, I'm going to use Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow Pomade in the shade Soft Brown. Alright, got both brows done. Camera overheated so you didn't get to see the second one. So next I'm going to prime my eyes with the Soft Ochre Pro Longwear Paint Pot by MAC. The first eyeshadow I'm going to go in with is Creme Brulee by Makeup Geek. Ooh. I'm going to put that all in the crease area. Next, I'm going to go in with Melt Cosmetics Love Sick Eyeshadow. I'm also going to focus the color on the outer corner of the eye. It doesn't have to be very neat on the lid because we are going to be covering up with the glitter and concealer later to make it like a half cut crease. I'm going back and forth and blending it with that. What is this? A Morphe M441 brush. So going back in with that Tarte Shape Tape, I'm going to go in and carve out the crease in the front. Okay, I don't like this brush. Stop dwelling on empty words Stop stalling in the doorway You can't 
Now I'm going to set that with a little bit of translucent setting powder. So there's no creasing. going back in with that lovesick and kind of blending that concealer into the eyeshadow a little bit more. So next I'm going to put glitter on the center of the lid where that concealer starts. I'm going to use the Too Faced Glitter Glue. Then I'm going to use the Maya Cosmetics Glitter in Golden Glow. I'm going to put that right in the center. And for the lid color, I'm going to use Max Loose Pigment in Vanilla. I'm going to spray my brush with a little bit of Fix Plus. Going in with that creme brulee shade again, I'm going to smoke it out on the lower lash line. Then I'm going to go back in with the lovesick and put it right over that. For eyeliner, I'm going to use the Ulta Liquid Liner in Matte Black. The mascara I'm going to use today is going to be the Smashbox Full Exposure. And for lashes, I'll be using the Rain Lashes in the style Texas. For the lips, I'm going to show you, you can either wear a nude or you can wear like a dark cup. I'm going to use the NYX Nude Lip Pencil, which I'm almost out of.
going to use Pure Hollywood Liquid Lipstick by Anastasia. And then I'm going to go in with the Sugar Sugar Marc Jacobs lip gloss. the darker one. So I'm gonna go in with the darker lip liner. Let's do Nightingale. Maybe that'll be good. We're gonna try. So I'm gonna go in with Nightingale MAC Lip Pencil. And then I'm going to go in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills in Craft. Ew, this one smells weird. guys and this is the finished look i hope you enjoyed watching this video as much as i enjoyed making it don't forget to like and hit the subscribe button and i'll see you in the next video bye